everyone we're back and yeah on to the next part I think I got it uh. oh man <laughs> I'm not doing so good right now Oh jeez, hello. Oh. oh. It took you a while to realize that you're on fire. Uh, I should not be recording right now, but it, it's like seriously, my older brother is you know what, what the hell hit me? My older brother is convinced that. He can make like an awesome. Oh. Oh. Uh, my older brother's convinced that he can make like the next best thing, you know, like the next best video stuff. And honestly, I think he's out of his mind because, like, he's convinced that he's gonna be like this. Uh, that just failed. I don't know where to go. <laughs> yeah, he's convinced he's gonna be like this big editor, director type thing, you know, like, and that uh, he can make a movie. And that's what he's trying to do right now. And honestly, I think he's just getting over his head. And normally, I fuck. <laughs> normally, I don't mind when he's doing it and stuff like that. You know, like I'll help. I'll I'll avoid helping as much as I can. But if fuck, <laughs> if I can't avoid it. I'll avoid, like, if I can avoid it, I'll avoid it. Oh my god! Sorry, I got a new keyboard and I'm not used to it, and so I don't have to press as hard. And so I'm little, like, I'm literally slamming on the button, on the keys, and it's not. She's not jumping. Ugh, okay. There we go. Oh, jeez. Yeah, anyway. Normally, I don't when he's like trying to do videos and stuff I just ignore it and stuff like that but the one thing that really like that just ticks me off all the time is he has this girlfriend and I swear to god she is his girlfriend despite how much he says like oh no we're not doing blah 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 He's always over at her house, and he will literally take, like, our dog food and stuff like that, 
and he'll take food from the house and everything and bring it over there without anybody knowing like he'll he'll literally just take food and it's kind of annoying especially when he takes our puppy Bonnie's food because Bonnie has chronic ear infections and so she needs special food because if she has like anything other than like if she has any chicken or something like that you know or anything with too much protein in it she'll get a really bad ear infection and so it's like that's really annoying ooh he's ugly you kept me waiting Alice have you never heard that punctuality is a virtue you and my dentist's assistant have much in common you're habitually late aren't you between your dim-witted daydreaming and your cream vanity, the hours just fly by. There's barely time for anything else. That the best you can do? Hurl second-rate insults, they don't hurt. Your family was expecting you to come to them, weren't they? Perhaps they thought you might warn them of the danger, being close to the source as you were. But they waited in vain, didn't they? And died for their trouble. You dick! We were all asleep. It was an accident. I... You selfish, misbegotten, and unnatural child. You smelled the smoke, but you were in dreamland taking tea with your friends. You couldn't be bothered. Nor was protected and spared. While your family upstairs roasted in an inferno of incredible horror. Dude, you're a dick. No. Get it. No. Ha! <laughs> I totally got thrown off. Man. Like. <clears throat> normally, I. You've kept me waiting, Alice. Have you never heard that punctuality is a virtue? Go. Uh. Ow. Oh. I have no clue what I'm doing, just so you guys know. I'm gonna die. Oh, knew it. I don't know how to beat the Jabberwocky. Maybe I should try my jacks. Go, Jack. Yeah, anyway, like I was trying to say, the thing that really takes me off is like, I do not like kids, I'm saying this now, like I don't mind kids, but little kids, you know, I do not like them, they just bug the hell out of me, and I hate it when Sean bring, like Sean and Amber come over and they bring Amber's one-year-old and three-year-old. I mean, seriously. They're cute and everything like that, but they are so freaking annoying. And 
normally we have to babysit them while they're in the house because Amber and Sean don't want to do it, you know? And it just gets so freaking annoying. And today, seriously, dude, screw you. Today, we. They came and everything, and sh like my brother was doing some thing, like talking with like some actors or whatever that he wanted to have in his movie or whatever it is, and so my mom and I had like my mom had to look after the kids, and they were upstairs in the spare bedroom. And my mom wanted to watch Law and Order because she really likes that show, and it was a new episode today, and she wanted to see it. So my mom asked me to look after the kids, and apparently there was like another little girl over, and so it was Amber's two kids, and then another. And then another little girl. And... Like, Amber's daughter, who's one, fell off the bed in the spare bedroom. And I was trying to calm her down and, you know, make her feel better and everything. And while I was trying to stop her from crying, the son and then the other little girl got into some candy canes that Sean had been keeping in the room. And so Hurry Alice. The eye staff is yours. The troops are gathered. Everything is ready. I'll deal with the Jabberwock. You are our champion. Lead us to victory in Queensland. Okay. But anyway. So by the time I realized that they had had like two or three candy canes and everything like that and so I went hmm I went and like I didn't really pay much attention to it because I mean it's not that big of a deal I mean it's not like some horrible thing that like the kids are gonna die from just having like maybe two or three candy canes right and so it was like okay Just so you guys know, this is actually as far as I haven't gotten this far ever. So uh, from here on, I will have no idea what I'm doing. That looks like Humpty Dumpty. Ass. Haha, -ha, I dodged you. Oh. Ugh. I'm watching like a guy I do I subscribe to do uh, the second like oh well, I've been watching um Dr. Iron Buddha's well he's changed his name to caretaker but I've been watching him do the second one and I so I'm jealous because you can't dodge in this game the second one you can dodge but the first game you can't hey dude Am I like supposed to kill you or something? Was that what I was supposed to do? Dude.
Whoa. <laughs> that was cool. I... Um... Uh, I so wish I had dodge. Oh my god. But, anyway, back to what I was saying. My mom went to go and watch the show and everything. And then, when... They got a hold of the candy canes and everything like that, I didn't think much of it. Because I figured, oh, okay, like, maybe one or two is fine. But then, my brother comes in, and he literally, like, as he's coming up the stairs, he's like, Hello? Anybody here? Like, you know, and he knew that we were here. And, the boy, Isaac, a three-year-old, he opens up the door to go say hi to my brother, you know? And he's like, no, no, get back in the room, Erica, why are you letting him out of the room? Why are you letting him out of the room? And I'm like, he just opened the door. I'm not letting him out of the room. I'm not, like, opening the door, you know, and saying, like, oh, go outside. Like, go on, go out. He literally opened the door the moment my brother said hello, you know? And it was like, oh my god. And he was getting pissed off at me. And then he started getting pissed off about how they had, there was like candy cane wrappers on the ground. And I didn't realize that they had had more than three, you know? Because apparently they had like a bunch and everything. But I didn't know. I only, as far as I knew, they only had like three. But apparently they had like 20, according to Sean. And he was getting all pissed off and everything. And I'm like, oh my god. Really? And yeah, he, he was getting all pissed off and stuff. And he was claiming, and then he freaking came into my room after I got annoyed and what came upstairs. And he's like, oh, I wasn't mad. I really wasn't mad. I wasn't the one getting mad. You were the one getting mad. Yeah, and it's like he's getting mad at me, and he actually said, "Oh no, I wasn't getting mad. I wasn't mad or anything." It's like, bullshit. You were so mad. And it's just, oh my god. Sorry, my brother pisses me off. Like seriously, he pisses me off. Like my favorite. Oh wow, my favorite thing that I find absolutely hilarious is how I remember being here anyway it's how he claims he doesn't eat anything and like he never eats or anything like that yet whenever he's in the house like whenever he's staying here there's like nothing like seriously the house is empty of food whenever he is here and he claims that I'm the one who eats everything and sometimes he'll even claim that I'm eating everything when I'm at work like seriously when I'm at work I'm not even here when I'm at work yet I eat everything in that like I'm the one that eats everything in the house like I admit I do bring stuff up in my room cool like, I do bring stuff up into my room, but 
it's usually like a bowl of cereal or something like that or a sandwich and I will pretty much eat it over like a few hours you know it takes like I don't eat a lot at once and so it's like oh, he, oh. Not in the mood for you. Man, yeah, seriously, it's like he claims like, oh, he doesn't eat anything. He hardly ever eats. Yet whenever he is here, there's no freaking food anyway. Like, the house is literally empty, and it's like, oh my god, shut up. And then he gets pissed off when we, like, when we, when we call him out on it, and he's like, oh, blah, 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 it's not me, it's not me. And he blames it on everybody else. And it's like, really? Really? Whoops. Totally thought I quick saved before then. Uh, sorry, I'm just not in a good mood today. As you guys can probably tell. I mean, my sister pisses, my older sister pisses me off too, but not as much as my brother. I mean, really, it's just, oh, it makes me want to tear my hair out sometimes. My older sister is more annoying than anything else. But, I can just annoy her right back. Sean, if I tried to... If I try to annoy him right back, he'll just start getting pissy and bitchy and blah blah blah. And it's like, oh. I mean, seriously, like you cannot say two words to the to him without him getting all pissed off and bitching. Oh, I went down that way. I remember once I bought myself um like it was like. These um, how should I do? How should I explain it? They're kind of like tortilla chips, but they're like multigrain, and they're extremely healthy. And I tried them once at school, like when I was still in school and everything like that. And I bought myself some of them, and I put them downstairs, you know, because I figured, oh, okay, they'll be fine and everything. Nobody will touch them. But no, no, that that didn't that didn't work. They were gone, like the next day, and there was like almost a full bag left. And I knew that nobody else touched them because my mom didn't doesn't like them. My sister wasn't home. My stepdad Rob was at work, and. Rick doesn't eat that kind of stuff. Like, he doesn't really do chips, you know? And so I knew that it had to have been Sean, so I commented on it. I'm like, so do you know what happened to my chips? And he was like, what do you say that I ate them? And I'm like, well, no, I'm just asking if you knew what happened to them. Like, did you see who ate them and everything like that? You know, and he's like, and he started getting bitchy with me about saying like how everybody blame like everybody always blames him and everything like that and like the they jump to conclusions and stuff like that and it's like 
he's never the one that eats everything and blah 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 and he was starting to get pissed off and everything and he was bitching and he actually started a fight like just because I asked him like do you know what happened to my chips I mean that's all I asked like I mean I did expect like I did suspect that he had eaten them all but I wasn't accusing him right away you know I was willing to give him the chance to defend himself because I figured like oh okay well maybe there's a chance that somebody else ate them and I just don't know you know and so but then he, he just started bitching at me he starts bitching a lot I mean seriously like you can't say two words to him he gets so f easily offended it's not even funny uh, I don't know if I'm going the right way. I'm just sort of wandering. I already went down there. So, clearly I've got to go this way. <sighs> Sorry. I just... My brother. Oh, my brother. I have a good relationship with my siblings, but at the same time, I don't. I mean, it's not. Ugh. We just piss each other off so much, it's not even funny. You know what? I think I'm actually supposed to blow that gate open with the Javel Walk staff. We saw a gate earlier. Yeah, I think we're supposed to blow that gate we saw earlier. Or up with the Jabberwock staff. See if I can find it again. Do 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 See I think we're supposed to blow this up with the Jabba Walk staff. Maybe? I don't know what to do. I think I've literally been everywhere. Okay. Is there like somewhere I need to? Oh, guys, I think I'm lost. Been lost for a while. This totally sucks. Already passed that like three, four times. I 
have a feeling I'm supposed to go into this thing, but how do I get in there? I don't think we've seen that before. There are the jacks, thank you. Maybe... We figured it out. Yes, we figured it out. Muhaha. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh. Huh. Okay, well, I'm going to end the video here. And in the we'll get farther. Sorry, most of this video was me wandering around lost and ranting about nothing. Well, oh, ranting about my brother. Yeah. So, in the next part, we'll figure out this little puzzle and then we'll get farther. I Thanks for watching. I hope you're enjoying these little videos and I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye everybody.